Hi, I'm DK with Adventures in Dirt. Welcome to another episode of The Weekly Dirt. Good to see you. Hey, if you'd like to be kept up to date on what's going on here in our metal detecting world, make sure you hit that subscribe button right there and check in with me every week as I try to bring you up to speed on things going on here in our metal detecting community. Hey, let's go check in with a great channel out west here. You wanna go do some Wild West hunting? You wanna check out some of these old Wild West frontier ghost towns? I'm telling you, no one does it better than this next channel. Let's check in with them this week. This is the Key Date Kid. Watch this. Pretty neat clay marble. First person to touch that in a really long time. All right, guys, got another target. Uh, it was ringing up about a 19 on the Knox. Uh, let's take a look at it. It's down in here. Popped it to here. And it is a sweet old button. And on the back it says Sterling. So that is a Sterling back on this button. And you can tell it's silver. Sweet. Got some silver. Ghost Town silver today. Right there. What is it? Oh, it's a V nickel. Beautiful V nickel. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Looks like a 1900. Sweet, that just made my day. Whew. See, there's a coin. Oh, it's silver. It's gonna be silver. Oh, it's a mercury. Sweet mercury dime. Looks crusty. Oh, it is a wheat. 1914, all the way right now. That is a 1914. That is a 1914D! It's a 14D! Oh, it is! It is! Oh my gosh! Look! Key date! That's a key date coin for the key date kid! Woohoo! Hey, that's exactly what you get when you're out hunting those ghost towns. I'm telling you, it's just some really interesting items that people have left behind from days gone by. Great channel. Everyone head on over there if you're not already a fan of the Key Date Kid. Links down below. And I'll tell you what, hey, he's not only a great YouTube channel, he's also the owner of Excalibur Shovels. So if you're looking for your next shovel, link's going to be down below to his website where you can go over there and give all of his shovels a look. He's got some good ones. Excalibur Shovels from the Key Date Kid. Go check them out. Hey, let's go check in with another cool channel, Digging Deep. That's right, Digging Deep up to some great stuff this week. Check it out. Digging Deep. Watch this. Here's a free room. Yeah. Shut oh. up! Uh, 1831. Are you kidding me? Hi, Doug. Hi. All right, well, this is a first for me. It's Tiffany and Company Sterling. Patton... 2019. 1909. <laughs> the people want to see your cool lock. Right, check that out. Simmons lock. Oh, that's cool. Yep. That's an old uh that's an old lock too, dude. Found something pretty cool. It is an old like kids badge. Police badge. It says WD on it. Doug found his first first good coin of the day. 1960 Silver Washington. Yeah, buddy. Doug Doug scream largey. <laughs> And I was going to record as I was walking over, and he's like, oh, never oh, mind, never it's a washer. Mind. No, it is a largey, fellas, ladies and gentlemen. It has a big, I bet you that's a big square nail. It could be. Hey, somebody used it as a washer. Yeah, I'm trying to get, oh, there we go. It's a braided. Can't really get a, it's 18, probably 1850 something. Dude, that's amazing, brother. There's, there's, there's 1912. It's a barber. It's a barber. Man, I was just saying, I haven't found a barber in a while. Oh, that's cool. 1912. Let's probably get a little bit more. Yeah, nice. Dude, that's... It's been used. Look at the end with the hammer type end. That's oh, dude. Hit. Dude, that is so cool, bro. All right, my next cool find. After, right after Doug, I found that spoon, and Doug found that. It's an old ice skate. So I found something really interesting. It's a horseshoe, but it's got uh, iron on the inside, too, and these big knobby thingies on the back. 
Huh. That's really... Oh my God, there's a face on it. No. -uh. No, seriously. Come here, look in the camera. It is a decoration for the house. What? Yes, come here. All kinds of cool finds coming out from Digging Deep. Just a great channel. Links can be down below to his channel. Go give him a big thumbs up. Say, hey, congratulations. Great finds. Saw you on the Weekly Dirt. Here to support you. Digging Deep. Everyone go give him a look. Links down below. Hey, when you can find some Civil War relics and also pull some big silver, boy, nothing's better, right? LA Relic Hunter, Louisiana Relic Hunter did exactly that. Let's check in with him. Watch this. Louisiana Relic Hunter. Check this out. Got something here. Oh, I think I got a breastplate. Oh boy. Hold on a second. It's a breastplate for sure. That's the lead that's still in the back. You can see where the pin, a little rust where the pin would have went. It would have went on the uh actually on the uniform, on the leather strap, went across their chest. Just dug a, another Spencer. Look at this. He just found a <laughs> bat wing. And that would have went on the end of a belt from a uh, soldier's uniform. Turn it over, Keith, let's see it, the whole thing. It's made of brass. And uh, we definitely know what it is. They're in all the ID books. They call them bat wings. And uh, awesome find, man. But there you go. That is a bullet. That's a three ringer, so there it is. Yep, yeah. that's that's what it is. It's an infill. That's a good bullet there. That's a Confederate bullet. That is awesome. Big old infill. Look at the size of that thing. Holy moly! Please be a coin. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a quarter. It's not that old. It's a 42. <laughs> Man, I was hoping for a big seat. It. Hey, <laughs> I'll take it. Swinging my XP. Just dug a, uh, looks like a spoon. But what's interesting about it is uh, I see new, I think New Orleans. Sure looks like it. Hey, look at this. Dang, we got silver. Keith got silver. Was it 1842, huh, Keith? Uh, I'd say my glasses are in the <laughs> Well, I got mine on, and I can see. There we go. 1842. Man, it's cool Civil War relics, and then you pull the large silver. Awesome. Congratulations, my friend. Tell you what, everyone head on over to his channel. Go give him a big thumbs up. Go check out his channel. He's always got great videos just like that. Louisiana Relic Hunter, LA Relic Hunter. Go give him a look. Link's going to be down below. Tell him you saw him right here on the Weekly Dirt. Hey, there's a cool holiday giveaway going on by the Texan Detector and Coin Collector. That's right. Link's down below to that one. Go over there. Give him a look. Good luck to you. Follow all the rules. Hope you win a prize from the Texan Detector and Coin Collector. Great channel. Go give him a look. Good luck. Hey, you know what's the best is when you can detect your own property and end up finding all kinds of incredible items. I'm telling you, Earth Unearthed, a great channel. Let's go give him a look this week and see what he's pulling out of his own property. Earth Unearthed. Watch this. No, that's the transformer exploding. Call the fire department.
Oh yeah, yeah, it's blowing up and it's smoking. <laughs> Holy shit! Call the fire department. In the snow or the rain or the ice cold wind, whenever, no matter what the weather, together. What is this? What are you? Any weather, we're together. You know, I really like this channel. He's really coming on strong. He has a great use of editing, great use of music. I think he produces a lot of his own music. So everyone go give him a look. Go become a fan of Earth Unearthed. Great channel. Go give him a look. Hey, make sure you hit that subscribe button right there. I want to wish you and your family a very Merry Christmas here from DK at Adventures in Dirt. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year to you. Check out these videos. I think you'll enjoy them. Have yourself a great week. I'll see you next Sunday.